What's up, guys? How are we doing? Uh, question for Coach. Uh, now that you've gotten to see Jerry Roberts, Keishon Hayward, I can go on and on. Like these five uh, transfers that you brought in the linebacker, what's your, what have been your overall impression of that, that group? Uh, very happy with what they're doing so far. You know, very competitive. They've made, they've definitely made us better. Um, I think I think right now the most important thing is to find out who's going to really rise to the top. You know, the good thing is great, a lot of competition. You know, one day it might be Trey Hayward pops in some, some drill work, then also the next drill you're going to see Jerry Roberts make some big plays. A guy like uh, Rashi Hodge has done a great job. He's popped in certain situations. So I think we've created a, a great deal of competition at the linebacker position right now, and it's really helped our program. You know, hard work. You know, you talk about a kid who just works his tail off day in and day out. He's, a, you know, he's one of those guys who uh, is always by Coach Brown's side. You know, comes in every single day looking for more ways to learn. So I, I think his his tenacity about learning the, learning the scheme and and keep on working and then showing up on the football field and, and special teams and all the situations we ask him to be, it gives him opportunity to get on the field. Malik Reed looked pretty quick in the one-on-ones with the running backs down there. What, what is his skill set? Good, you know, another another solid, better than solid guy. You know, he's he's got he's got a nice physical physique. I uh, can run a little bit. He's I think he's got a nice knack at the pass rush position. So we're you know right now we're as a staff every every day we're going in evaluating, looking for the niche that every guy can help us with. You know, it might be a pass rush, maybe it's a third down guy who can cover. Um, but Malik has certainly done a good job, and again, you know, all those guys have really done an outstanding job in terms of competition. So they're making it hard on us right now. Oh, well, the first thing, you know, when you, you're looking for athleticism and speed, guy who can run. Um, you know, the, the game of football's changed. It's not, you know, it's not, it's not a bunch of guys in a box and, and it's hard nose. It's a lot more athletic. It's spread out. So you need your guys to be able to cover, uh, rush the passer, cover, in, cover in the, in the, uh, on the back end, play some man-to-man, -man, be physical at the point of attack. And, and again, our mentality is we're, we're always, we're always going to try to stop the run, you know. So we're looking for guys who are going to be physical, step up and stop the run, and then to try to get them in third down situations, give us a chance to get off the field. Christian Young told us the other day that he played all spring knowing that he had a knee injury, but he wanted to prove to the coaches like, what kind of player he was. What does that say to you that he was willing to do that? Oh, you know, I mean, he's, he's, a, he's, he's one of the best team guys we've got. You know, a guy who's, uh, he puts his body out there every day, uh, goes out there and plays hard. He's uh He's a great leader. You know, he's not the, he's not a loud guy, but he's a great leader just among the group and on the football field. He lets his play uh, make his statement. But uh, you know, Cy has gotten better every day. He's gotten on the football field. I think I'm looking for a, a great things from Cy this season. To be honest with you, Coach Carroll was talking a little bit about how you guys split up the practices today. What did you get out of that, Coach? Yeah, the nice thing for the younger guys, we can really we can we can tone it down a little bit in terms of the teaching piece. You know, I think that's more important. Sometimes as you get going, you you, you take for granted some of the things these guys might not know. So it was a good chance for us to really install, teach, go back go back to basics, fundamentals, and then show look for some guys who show up athletically on the football field today. Do you, do you like just the idea of getting more hands-on time with them, whereas out here, I mean, there's only so many reps. Yeah, no, it was great. It was like, you know, you took that you took that group and they were like our varsity for the day. You know, get to coach them hard, see what they can do, put them in a little pressure situations and see how they react. And a couple guys rose up and a couple guys need to continue to work on. One more question for Coach. Is Eddie out San Antonio? Is he with your group or is he on We've made him, yeah, I think he's made the transition down to the defensive end right now. So we, we, we thought that would be a good position for him. And he's been he's so far so good. He's been really good at that position. When did he make that move? Uh, I was right at the right, right, right at the start of camp. All right, thank you, coach. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you.